so um yeah i thought let's let's try and retarget the skeleton to like this found model and sketch fab the gun and things and then it was a bit of a nightmare in the end i just i got rid of his rig and rebound him to the um uh moto rica rig um and then the hands were all mangled and stuff it, it was still i mean i just couldn't get the transfer to work so doing the binding it to the motor rig, to rig fixed it and then i also put an hdr on the background and a few blocks and that and so this is it Um, yeah, so didn't take long at all. Uh, I mean, okay, so it's, it's, his hands are a bit, uh, his arms are a bit pipe cleanery, and uh, could do with better textures. I had to sculpt the hand to get it to, yeah, it's not, you know, it's got its issues, but for you know, I mean, I guess the next challenge is to to do something like this in Unreal, um, or just get the the motor Rika animation into Unreal, you know, get the character and and do all the but even just with an HDR, I mean, it's just amazing how much you can do. I mean, okay, the blocks are also a bit, a bit crap, a little bit low res, but um, yeah, I mean, that came out pretty well. I mean, obviously the guy's a bit ridiculous with his uh, civilian stuff and the army stuff all mixed up. It doesn't really matter. It was just all. It was just how quickly you can do stuff. So it like 20 minutes to do the. Thing. It took forever to do the figure. It probably took. It took longer to do the. Um, the binding to the to the uh, armature, and then fixing the hands, and it was that that yeah that did take some time, but it still was fast. I wasn't getting any decent results with the retargeting, you see. So um, so that's that. Anyway, I just thought you know we're just yeah just yeah <laughs> that's it. Okay.